it is so hard yeah getting my wig started shifting i had to go and apply some parts to be again because like i don't know if this wig thing is for africa because like that's why it kind of like removes my gut to be i don't know i think because i saw it literally literally exactly where the wig is so it was like if i was out i was feeling like getting embarrassed <laughs> Yeah, but then I was still gonna embody everything that I did. Like, you know me. I got myself some ice and some water to keep me cool. I think I should actually get a fan when I'm doing those things because changing, putting on clothes, taking them out, putting them on, it's, it's, it's work. I know y'all are seeing this dress. You're like, can we just start with the how? I mean, like, let me take a sip. Okay, right now, this is the body con that I was telling you about. I know it doesn't make me excited as a short one but then this is like some type of a classy dress it's still skin tight and it's also on the joint life and i think it was about the same price if it was not 270 it was about 250 i don't want to lie it wasn't um 500 or 600 grand so it was like they it is um this t-shirt materially it's stretchy so you can um, downsize if you like i chose extra small but then it's not as skin tight as i like but then i like the way it makes me feel i like how comfortable i am and how all the parts of my body are actually curved out as you can see and it's doing the things it's doing the things and um i'm here for it i'm here for it so i want this dress with my new heels when i do my shoe and bag haul i'm thinking of doing like shoe and jewelry haul like like hauling just for that you know and just not mix everything up i actually should have done that um because i've actually i'm gonna do the hat and bikini haul i had a hat that i wanted to show you then i decided i'm like mm, i'm gonna show you guys on the pool or beachwear type of haul and then this is what the dress looks like i'm not wearing any bra of course because you know i hate bras free the nipple <laughs> oh my god so basically it has that slim line at the back not too slim because it can cover like up to here and then um it has this thing which is like it's slim line and it brings out your shoulders and your neckline and all that type of good edge that i actually like to to wear and i love the fact that it's also nudish and it also makes my melanin pop i'm telling you i'm loving this joint life um this joint life life <laughs> this joint life um from zara so this dress is also from zara everything i've tried on is from zara if it's not from zara i'm gonna mention that it's not from zara so guys um this is the length of it it's up here it can go down to my um down to my knees but i choose to bring it up here so that it um it actually gives me a shape it gives me curves and it's not too long you know it doesn't look like i'm going to church um there's nothing wrong with going to church but then you know if i want to go out and still look sexy and full stuff i don't want to look like i'm just from church so yeah i said what i said i said what i said so guys, the next item guys this is basically a t-shirt dress my sister um my sister kind of like hates it she's like it looks like i'm wearing a night dress but i love it like this is dirty i took it out from the washer because like i'm always wearing it like because like i've been wearing it today if it wasn't dirty so it has to get washed so it's basically it's the right size it's the right length and it's in the size extra small so you guys can can tell the type of critique that i have without this curves and this girls i'd be like you know so basically this is what it looks like i can pick up my hands like this and it's still comforting but then i actually i actually i can't get away from the fact that it's it's made up of like a t-shirt it's just a longer t-shirt what i basically do is put my biker shorts underneath so that when i bend over or do anything i like i kind of like feel safe i don't know because it is safe i'm not going to say that t-shirt dress aren't safe because like there are dresses which are shorter than this one there are dresses which are actually shorter than this one but then i still have that paranoia that oh it's still a ski bar so i actually have to put tight underneath um i don't know i'm just like i think i'm at that age where i'm like i get paranoid where well, I don't want my lady parts flying around unless unless I want them to fly around you know that's that's like a different story I mean it's in the type oh it's in the color grayish 
oh yeah it's not getting washed out so it's in the color grayish and it's a little bit wrinkly and everything and it looks nice because it's in the color like dark grayish it could be dark and i've also worn this as a t-shirt on my other post on instagram if you're not following me on instagram what have you been doing with your life because i'm actually rolling out this good outfit ideas i actually think they're good i don't know i don't know about you i think they're nice i think they're cute cute come on come on don't be a point dexter leave a comment down on my commentary and let me know what you think about this t-shirt dress would it be something that you like would it be something that you have because i know us ladies would take stuff from our husbands from our boyfriends and then we wear their t-shirts and it's basically the same thing i, I wear this as a t-shirt t-shirt i actually put jeans and i tuck it in a little bit and then um it literally becomes a t-shirt and then but i basically like wearing it as a t-shirt dress um i recently wore it on my uh, the trip before this one um when it was based but they i just decided to just slip it on because it's just an easy slip on top of thing and when i'm chilling it's a slip on it's an easy slip on top of thing so without further ado it's just a, a plain manchi t-shirt dress let's get to the next item this is the longest haul i've ever done it's anywhere it's okay you baddie so now we have on a corset we're taking it back. <laughs> okay, that was the dorkiest move ever. So basically, I've got a corset on. This corset is also from Zara. So you guys know that you don't have to go out of the country or, or go online to look for this corset. This corset was from Zara. It was literally the last size that I haven't worn it because I'm actually looking for something that I'd wear it with. Because like with this corset, I have a lot of high-waisted jeans. So high-waisted jeans would be like this. Or I can um, actually wear it with the low rise. Because I don't want to wear like this corset and then sort something high waist. And then my waist is just congested and I won't be as comfortable as I'd like to be. So this is what the material of the corset looks like. It's um, It has this little frills frills and then it comes up to here and it does a little V. So um, this is, I think this is in the size extra small. It's in stretchy material. I'd actually um, ask you to actually do not size down, don't size up. Make sure that it's your right size um before purchasing your corset make sure that you try it on that's all i can tell you make sure that you try it on this is actually one of my favorites it's not my favorite favorite but it's one of my favorite latest buys because like i just bought it recently and it is flipping amazing this is what it looks like in the back it's a book chubby corset because like i've never known a corset that has so and then it shows off the best part of the body of course and then um this is what the material looks like i just i'm just gonna show you what the material looks like it feels like i've been doing the haul forever so this is what the corset looks like i'm wearing it with my joggers with my nike joggers so mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. how low can you go okay i can't go that laura <laughs> So basically this is what it looks like. I don't have anything bad or anything good to say because I haven't worn it out. Maybe when I worn it out, I'd have something and be like, oh, okay, this was like that, 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 that. But then um, for me, it's just doing it now. Like every time I try it on, it just does it. Like every time I try it on, it just convinces me why I bought it. Like no regrets, no regrets, no regrets, no regrets at all. So let's get to the other item. What is that? Hmm. I think I have a top that I need to try on. <laughs> but then um I'm just thinking I don't wanna get makeup on it. Um should I? Okay, let me because I already bought it out here, so I might as well try it on. Your girl is getting lazy. I don't I don't wanna lie, it's just too long. But mini and tons. This is what I do for you guys. Make sure to share my videos, make sure to subscribe to keep me here on YouTube. Because the more you are subscribing, the more you push this algorithm to advertise me to more people, the more I stay and bring this type of content to you guys because I have a lot of great fashion ideas, I have a lot of great vlog ideas, I have a lot of great makeup ideas. If you like the way that i do my makeup today i can actually show you i'm the type of person i do makeup makeup full blown i when i do makeup i actually downsize and then do something minimalistic like what i have on today and it's cute hi sweet i almost at the end this is a haul to neck Ooh, one of the cutest tops i own no regrets you know when you buy something and then you look at it and you're like why did i buy it 
I'm actually wearing it the wrong side. But then who cares? I'm not, I'm not even taking it off. You know how hard it was putting this with your full face of makeup? Shh, girls, you know. You know. There's no way I'm taking this off. So basically, this is a halter neck top. <laughs> I don't think it looks good like that. I, I think we can, we can make it work. So basically, this is what it looks like. It's just the white stretchy fill. I'm going to get closer because it's white. It shouldn't do anything. It's just like... It's just like white type of stretchy fill. It's a halter neck. It comes up to here. It's not up to here. So your makeup does not actually get onto it. So the only time you get this on is taking it off and taking it off. So basically this is what it looks like. It's a little crappy, 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 top so yeah basically this is what it looks like it is cute it is lovely it makes me look posh it makes me look like i got money Ooh, she got money <laughs> i love it though i love it it's it's so effortlessly tight and then i will not be wearing this with the bra free the nipple free the nipple free the nipple <laughs> That's me, but then if you prefer to wear this with the bra, you can wear it with a half bra or whatever type of thing that you like to clean yourself on and just make yourself hard to breathe and you know what what whatever you want. So yeah, basically this is it and we're going to the um I think the last item. The last item is um sweatpants. The sweatpants, the sweatpants, they are also from Zara. I think everything was from Zara except the outer bag. Damn, bruh. <laughs> Go. Zara, if you're seeing this, sponsor your girl. Sponsor this. You see this girl? I'm sponsoring you. You might as well sponsor me. I mean, like, damn. <laughs> no lies there. No lies told. Let's get to the last item on this haul. Ah, this thing's match. Match. Okay. I. <laughs> so guys, these are the sweatpants. You know me, I love me some good sweatpants. Oh, booty baby, booty. <laughs> so basically, these are some black sweatpants. They have like an elastic that just like. It holds on to your waist like for dear life and they have this like two little cute things here. I love the fact that they're white every time I wear them with the white thing it actually looks like oh it's a set but no it's not but it looks good it looks good it looks good it's just basic sweatpants um, they're not the skinny type of sweatpants they just like open at the bottom they are grown sweatpants mm -hmm. these are grown sweatpants oh here comes the noise in the Calvary. These are the grown up type of sweatpants. Um, they're good because they don't actually carry on those type of dusty whitish things that they usually have offer because I'm a dog owner, so you guys would know. Lastly but not least, I'd like to talk about this beautiful mask from Steve Martin. This is a Steve Martin mask. It actually has something that you put inside, which I have. Um, which actually, um, this is my going out type of mask and I also bought it at Steve Martin. I'm gonna wear it so you guys can see it. Bougie. Bougie. And it has the Steve Martin up in here. And this is actually called the bandana type of mask. I'm not sure if you guys can hear me because all this type of thing it's um it's the bandana material and it has this thing that you can actually um cinch it in or out but i actually choose to cinch it out because like i have problems with wearing masks because they actually take away my breath like literally so this is what the mask looks like oh it matches my nails ooh, 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 ooh. Mm. It kind of does, hey. Um, so yeah, basically this is what the mask looks like. This mask was 110. They had this in black and pink. So I chose the black one because I wanted to wear it with different types of outfits. So it actually also has this. 
that you can actually bend your nose like with you guys who are so 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 good in a service like you're like pinching it up in your nose so this is what you can do with your mask so you see tens looks after you guys i'm a, who you know does a how and includes a mask i'm gonna dare you guys i'll wait <laughs> So guys, we have to look fashionable and also stay safe. I want you guys to survive this pandemic and I also want myself to survive this pandemic and still have an audience to actually cater to. So I suggest that when you buy nice, um, nice clothing, you also think about getting a fashionable mask. It's actually going to make you, um, it's going to give you that enthusiasm to actually put on a mask. So I suggest that you look at the mask. Um, Zara, I know Cotton On has cute masks. Zara has, um, I, I don't want to lie. Sports, uh, Zara, I've never seen. Sports scene, they have a mask. Because if Zara had a mask, I would have had it. Sports scene has a mask. Um, Steve Martin has like cute masks. I know they also have leather ones. I actually want the leather one because child, that's, that's, that's better. It's just imagine me and then I'm like, leather mask. Whoop. Girl, that could be trouble. But then um, lately I've been using the KN95 mask because they actually protect my lipstick because they are like this. They do like a birdie type of thing, like a bird. Not a birdie, like a bird. So they, they don't touch up on your lipstick. So when I take them off, I can wear lip gloss, I can wear anything and I still look cute at the end of the day. So that's the most important thing. I'm cute and safe at the same time. So that's the most important thing. I'm not gonna show you guys the hats. I know that you saw the hats, but the hat is gonna be um on the bikinis. I'm gonna um, incorporate the hats with the bikinis. I don't wanna, you know, um, you know, you know, so guys, I'd like to say thank you so much. Thank you so much for sticking through with me for watching these videos. So Miss Lady also wants to say bye, so I'm gonna incorporate her here. Right now it's the end of the vlog, as I've said, and we have Princess Shadi up here. She also wants to say bye. Um, did you like taking the video? Yes. Did you enjoy it? Yeah. Tell them goodbye. You will see them next time on the next vlog. My vlog. Bye -bye. So guys, Tinitanza Gufa will see you next time. Bye!